Wait, they have the Powerpuff Girls. Do they have Mojo Jojo? No, I don't see him. <laughs> I guess that means it would be a no-no. All right, guys, today we are in Wesley Chapel, Florida. Look at these palm trees. How totally awesome is that? But we are here to see this Spirit Halloween that used to be a Charming Charlie. There's a lot of them that used to be a Charming Charlie. What happened to Charlie? Anyways, before it gets too hot, let's go in here and see what kind of Halloween goodness they have in store. So guys, before I even get started, I am on the hunt for those universal bag clips that have Michael Myers and Chucky in them, and I cannot find them. I got the girl working here in the back looking for a case right now because I do not see any up here. But what the heck is this? Look at this, how cool. It's a boo lamp. <laughs> and this bag is pretty dang cool. I just might have to buy one of these today. These are the other ones that I have not bought yet. They got chunk and sloth in there and some other goonies stuff and gremlins. Okay guys, unfortunately they do not have those, but we're gonna take a look around here anyway and see what kind of awesomeness we can find anyways. And holy crap, just when I think I've seen it all, we have a plush Banks that is going home with me today. Try me, where do I try? I'm supposed to squeeze or something. Hmm, okay, let's try this one. Come on, Binks, do what you're gonna do. Okay, so I found the button. It's like right on Binks's neck, but he's not doing anything. And there's a little power pack here where I turned it on, I turned it to try me, and he's still not doing anything on either of them. But how cool is that? What have you done with my Thackeray? Away, beast! All right, let's keep on moving here for a minute because I gotta see if they got any animatronics. This is a very small store, actually. I don't see any animatronics at all. And some stores are just like that. They only have like the costumes and masks and some basic props. I wonder if they at least have the zombie babies or the secret keeping cat. Probably over here somewhere if they do. Hmm, no secret keeping cat yet. Nope, I don't see any zombie babies or secret keeping cats. But let's go ahead and look at what they do have, guys. Check this out, they have tons of Nightmare on Elm Street stuff, including one, two, three, all three of the different Freddy gloves. And they have, oh, look at this. Here's a Freddy mask I haven't seen in the other stores. I think I saw this maybe last year, but not this year at all. They have this one and my favorite, Nightmare on Elm Street 4. I love this mask. Plenty of Friday the 13th stuff. And this is a really cool mask right here. I know we've looked at this a couple of times, but it's just slightly different from this one right here. But it's awesome. Pretty good selection in the shirts here. It does look like they're sold out of a small handful, including the Ghost Fates shirt that we absolutely love. But I kind of like this Creep Show shirt here too. It reminds me of uh, Poltergeist. And I almost ordered a Poltergeist shirt the other day from, I think, Fright Rags or something. You know what? Let's go back to the masks for a minute, guys. I just want to see what kind of different stuff they have in here. Wait, look at this Barney inflatable costume. I think we've looked at this before, but there's actually a new documentary coming out about how much people hated Barney. My kids absolutely loved Barney. I remember my kids watching Barney, but adults absolutely hated him. Don't worry, Barney. I love you. And guys, this is the chain that was on the Rasta Grim the other day. I don't even remember what store that was, but that was absolutely hilarious. I love when they put different hats and stuff on Grim. I would die if I went into a store one day and they had this outfit on Grim. Or the hot dog, that would be absolutely insane. All right, let's not get off track. Let's come on over here to the masks. Why do people make fun of the way I say masks? How am I supposed to say it? Mascuses? Let's look at some of the mascuses. No matter how many times I see this grandma, it cracks me up. And we have the bald old man up here. I don't know if I've seen the evil ringmaster. They have the universal creature and the Frankenstein, but I have only seen the mummy in like two stores. 
I bet this guy's seen more. I bet this guy read the map wrong with no eyes. I should get this hippie poncho for Marion. That's actually pretty cool and she loves the tie-dye. I just wish they actually had that headband too and I don't see it anywhere here. I do see leaves. Here's a feather headband and here's flower headbands. But this is more of like a multicolored braided headband. Look at the flower sunglasses. That is hilarious. And the fringe boot covers. Yeah, she's got those on too. I love that outfit. And then we got Danny the Greaser over here, stranded at the drive-in. And they got the astronaut suits. I don't know if I told you guys, one year my son made his own astronaut suit. Even made the helmet out of like a giant ball and paper mache. I'll put the picture in here if I can find Find it. it actually turned out even better than these. I think the only animatronic thing in here at all are the Lydia sidesteppers. You guys apparently didn't like the video that I made that I put this guy in the thumbnail, but I thought it was hilarious because I thought it was Mr. Hanky the Christmas Pooh. One eye! Fortnite guff costume, inflatable. I have never seen this one. How strange is that? What the heck, Fortnite man cakes? His head is a stack of pancakes. I attended a wedding the other day where most of the people were dressed in regular clothes, but some of them were dressed in Halloween costumes, and one of them even had a cat in the hat jumpsuit on with the hat. What in the world is up with that? <laughs> Whoa, what the heck? Look at this Venom mask. Look at the tongue on that thing. This is disgusting. Disgusting. <laughs> this is a Ruby's mask, and I don't think I've ever seen it in one of these stores before. Another guy at the wedding was dressed up in one of these Naruto suits with a wig on and everything, but his was like blue. It was like the most awkward thing ever. Wait, they have the Powerpuff Girls. Do they have Mojo Jugo? No, I don't see him. <laughs> I guess that means it would be a no-no. Oh, they have some Scream stuff over here, but I think this is just the kids' costumes because look how tiny these masks are. I know I point that out every time, but that is just so hilarious to me. Let's see if they have any Scream stuff over here. We do have lots of Beetlejuice. Oh, right here. Where, uh, okay, yeah. <laughs> Light up ghost face. They have the red viper face. They have the hat, the socks. They have the choker and the knife. This is the first time I've seen this and I don't really get it. A ghost face bleeding machete. I don't recall him ever using a machete in any of the Scream movies. But they do have the chrome mask. Not that it was ever in any of the movies either, but it is way cool. And I do love this Chucky shirt right here. It's like a Hawaiian shirt, only it's a good guy's shirt. If they had my size, I would have worn this to the wedding. Or maybe even this. I'm glad to see they're still putting out the Hugs the Clown costumes, but they need to hashtag bring Hugs the animatronic back. All right, we got lots of Pennywise stuff over here from both of the movies. We got lots of trick-or-treat stuff over here, including the masks, the outfits, the Holly Hobar in these masks, and we have lots of Halloween stuff here. We have the original, part two, 2018, and Halloween ends. Halloween 1 is definitely my favorite movie, but I think Halloween 2018 mask is my favorite mask, probably because the hair looks the most appropriate on this one. I honestly didn't care too much for the 2018 movie, but the mask is totally awesome. I was considering getting these before I leave today, but there's only a handful, and I just want to buy a whole case because I want to make sure I get them all. I'll bet you anything this is the bones right there because it's so small and thin. I think I am going to go ahead and get this bag, though. I'm not sure what I'll use it for, but it is pretty cool. I'm going to leave a whole stack of stickers, guys, right here in front of Kelsey. Come get them. All right, guys, that's it. Wesley Chapel, Florida Spirit Halloween. This is probably the smallest spirit I've been in, but they were very well stocked. The only thing they didn't have was the big animatronics. They only had that one uh, Lydia sidestepper. I didn't even see any other sidesteppers. But if you're looking for costumes or anything else, get on down here. <laughs>